What is go happening everyone and welcome to my main farm. The view from this window is inspiring, don't you think? Yes, Leah, I do think. I do think it is quite inspiring, although I cannot see out of it, if I'm being honest. <laughs> Can't see a damn thing. Uh, weather report. It's going to be cloudy with gusts of wind throughout the day. And Fortune Teller says, Welcome to Wellwick's Oracle, the only show where the voice, spirit, the voice of the spirits is channeled directly to you. Spirits feel neutral today, the day it's in your hands. Queen of Sauce rerun. I already know how to make carp surprise. Let's check on our wine. That is all in our casks. Uh, if you did not see my live stream, this is the cask area in your basement of your house, and this is the optimal layout. Uh, this layout I found online. I, it, I did not create it myself, I'll be honest. Um, but this layout is the optimal layout. This is the most amount of cask you can fit that you can still get access to each and every cask throughout the entire floor. I have seen uh, videos where people have casks here in these two spots on the stairs. I've not been able to place them there though. I don't know how they do that. But there's plenty of casks, honestly. It's a boatload of casks. I'm not even sure how many it is. But it's a lot. I'm not going to count them all. Feel free to pause the video and count them if you want. It's a lot, though. You make a lot of money off of that. But it takes a long time. And I already have an entire batch of starfruit wine ready to go. So, the rest of the starfruit wine uh, that I get, I just sell. Uh, hey there, I had some extra wood lying around. I thought, you maybe, I thought maybe you could use it. Take care, Robin. Well, thank you, Robin. I do appreciate that. Grab this iridium, stick it in here because it's not enough to do anything with. We will check our trees and get our fruit off of the, our trees. And we'll store that down here in our jelly area. Now in my live stream, we picked all of these crops that you see missing here, um, of which there were a bunch. Uh, not quite as much money as I would have thought though. I mean, we made like a hundred something thousand gold off of it, which is good. Just not anywhere near the amount of money I thought we would make. So definitely doing some of your orders and stuff, like making wine and all that, definitely much more profitable. Much more profitable, indeed. Let's go ahead and grab you. And we have some iron ore. Perfect. Um, let us head on up and we will check on all of our animals. Let them out of their little houses. Hello, chickens. All of the chickens in life. Oh my gosh. Has anyone ever seen this many different colors of chicken in one place? I think not. I mean, maybe. I know in some places, I don't know if they do that anymore. Do they still dye chickens for Easter? Easter just recently passed. Um... I did not see anywhere advertising that, although I remember as a kid getting one of those. Uh, the chicken did not survive for very long, unfortunately. Um, and to think about it, I can't imagine what the process must be like for the chicken. Honestly. Be walking around pink and purple and green and blue and... It's just weird. But let us let our rabbits out. We will check on our ducks. Hello, ducks. Wank, wank. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Hello. Hello, duckies. I see you quacking away. You may come out. And finally are dinosaurs. I don't know if these dinosaurs, I guess because of the way in which we are making them, we're lucky if we get an egg a day. With our chickens and stuff, obviously they produce eggs every day and the ducks produce eggs every day or every two days or whatever it is. I don't know how often, I think they produce every five days the dinosaurs do. We've got a lot of them though, as you can see, because we just keep making more with the dinosaur eggs that we're getting. But, uh, it's not like we get an egg every day. You, you'd think we would at this point, but we really don't. Um, let's grab all of 
of this. And let's drop these eggs off in our uh, mayonnaise machines. Bring the wood down there, the iron down there. Let's get all the duck eggs in here. We got a lot of duck eggs. Be a lot of duck mayonnaise. Should fetch a pretty fair bit of money. And we still got all these other eggs left to go. Um, let's go grab the rest of our other stuff. We should have enough space, I think. Hello, pigs. And Dewey. And Dewey. Can you. And Dewey. Stop. Pepper. Can, there we go. Piggy pig pig. Oinky oink oink. Here we go. And down we go. And we will let you guys out. And then let's head in here. Grab the milk and whatnot from our goats. Hello, goats. How are you? Grab all of this goat milk. And then grab... Oh, I guess we need to let you out. We will pop in here and say hello to all of our cows. Hello, cows. Are you a new cow? You are. Sir Moselot, our baby cow. Parent is Rumina. Now, how many cows do we have currently? Can you... Nestle? 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 Whatever your name is. Can you stop? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so we have the maximum amount of cows. So somebody's got to go. So we can keep producing more cows. My bell. Three months. Five months. Five months. Five months. We're not going to get rid of you. That's your baby. That just seems rude. Uh, Zotabel, five months. Nestle, five months. Galley, five months. No bowl, five months. Quick, you're only a one-month-old cow. Milksy. Oh, Milksy. You have been with us for quite some time. Moo Moo. Milksy, we love you. We thank you for your service. You may depart on new adventures, sir. New adventures. Who knows what world awaits Moo, uh, Milksy? Hopefully another farm. With some new friends. Sheep, how are you? And I believe we only have 11 of you, correct? Uh, yeah, 11 of you. So we still have the potential to make another sheep. And we will grab their wool. And let you out, finally. There we go. Good lord, it's already 210. Time flies when you are farming for fun. Alright, nothing to do in there. Let's go get all of our machines a going. Look at all of the duck mayonnaise. Oh my lord. It is going to be so much monies. Can you not, please? Thank you. You get in there, and you in there. And you in here, and that's it. Grab the wool, get it on the go. Only a few pieces of it today. We grab all of this mayonnaise. Mayonnaise. And put you down there because you're going to get sold. Get all of you up here so we can get you in these machines a going. A going. Eggs. Oh my lord, all the eggs. And all the mayonnaise. There we go. Now, dump you. Perfect. Uh, we don't need that rusty spur. Let's go pick up the wood and this other thing. Uh, nope. Why am I looking in there? You go in here. No. Oh, we don't have room for you. Uh, okay. What do we have in here that can come out? You can come out. Um, I 
I guess these geodes can come out and come with us. We can go have Clint open these things up and see what we get. Uh, we have a bunch of them. Uh, you can just get sold. We've already given one of you away. Uh, I don't think anybody likes petrified slime. I wouldn't want petrified slime. I mean, to be fair, it'd be cool to have one to s set up somewhere, I guess, but it's not exactly a necessity. Oh, why did we... Why did we grab all the coal? We definitely don't need all the coal. Can you please go back in there? Thank you. Okay, let's head off to Clint's. Um, we'll take our horse, but we are going to go by way of Minecart. Oh, can you please give me that hazelnut? And this hazelnut. And to town we go. Clint, my good man, please. What? What? Ah, oh, dang it. Well, poop. Um, guess we can go to the quarry and bust up everything that is not a mineral. Our goal with this is to eventually, eventually, eventually let all of the minerals fill out all of the spots in the quarry. So we get rid of everything that's not a mineral rock. We try to, at least. And just let everything kind of keep going as it is. Grab this one and this one and bust you up. You. I think that's it. No, I see you. I see you. I see you. You tried to hide. You failed. You failed at hiding, I'm afraid. And... Do we want to go down the mines? No. I think we just want to go back to the bus stop. So, we are almost at our 10 million goal range, which we are hoping to get to because we really want the clock to put somewhere on our farm where we will no longer have to deal with stupid debris everywhere. Hazelnuts, you can go in here. Rocks, you can go in here. Now let's see, where are we at achievement-wise? Um, pretty much sold one of everything, so that's good. We have not caught all the fish. We're not even remotely close to catching all the fish. We still have quite a few artifacts to snag up. Um, we have... So we did not catch every fish. We have not cooked every recipe. We have not completed the museum collection. We have not done 40 health warning. 15 of each crop. That's part of what we were doing with what we were making there. Craft one of every item. Good lord. Uh, don't know that we've done that. There's a lot of items though. I don't know what we've crafted and what we haven't. I wish it showed you. I wish it showed you like, yes, you've crafted one of these before. I mean, I guess if we crafted it, you would think it'd be on the farm somewhere so we could go around and search for it, but not necessarily. Grab all of you. We have a slime on the loose. Slime, get your butt back in here. You guys follow me over here to this corner. And... Haha. -ha. You are stuck in your little fenced in area. I guess, honestly, I don't really need the fenced in area anymore. You know what? I'm just gonna chop you up. Well... I guess we'll keep you there for now. Now that I have the the slime charming ring, I don't really need to worry about the slimes trying to eat me. So so I don't know that I necessarily need to have uh have the uh the fence there, but we'll keep it there for now. It's not really not really causing any problems. 
and shut all of the barn doors, even though tomorrow is not a rainy day. It just makes it easier for us to talk to all of the animals. How are we on hay? Uh, we can put a little bit in, I guess. Um, let's keep it fully stocked. Added 105 pieces, and the rest of you can go in there. Let's head. We can toss you in Ben. Let's go in here and gather all of these bits. So much stuff. And let's get all of these truffles going. Not a massive amount of truffles today. Unless I missed some. Did I miss some? Uh, I'm not seeing where I missed any. So, I'm going to say no. No extra truffles. It's a little disappointing, honestly. You, you. Don't need 27 of you. We'll keep 20 of you on hand. Uh, I'll just sell that one piece of wood. And these couple of coal. We have plenty of that. We will throw this iron bar in here. Okay. Uh, slimes. Where are we putting slimes? Slimes not going in there? Where do we have the slimes? Slimes, where are you? You're in here. And I believe you're in here because we were going to make... Oh, we were going to make more... Um. More of these, which we need gold bars to do, which we have plenty of. Uh, let's go over here and just see how many. We only need three. Uh, or should I say we only really have the room for three, honestly. could put things on the end here where the lamp posts are, but I don't think I'm gonna. I think I'm just gonna leave it like this. I think that's plenty good enough. It's like our production area. I wouldn't mind another one of these sheds. Um, and I'm thinking about what I'm gonna do with all the animals. I don't know... I don't know that we want to keep all the animals. I'm thinking about... I mean, there's space to build more barns, though. I'm thinking about building out, um... Like, taking the barns and making a, uh... A spot to put a bunch of kegs in. Rather than just down here with the sheds that we have. Because I can show you. We have some sheds down here. Again, if you didn't see it in the live stream. There's sheds down here. And this is where we have, we have wine in these two. And we have jelly up in the last one. And we have one on the outside so that we can see when these are done. We always fill that one last so that we can see when all the jelly's done and see. Oh, I missed one. Did you see that? You, sir, got away last time. Count yourself lucky count yourself lucky that you've gotten a break uh, we've been putting rhubarb in but we are almost flat out of rhubarb um, we're gonna have to start using some of our other fruits but we have a boatload as you can see of other fruit so there's no no love laws there we also have a boatload of ancient fruit and star fruit and coffee beans and all these things that we're putting in the kegs so we are not short on supplies by any stretch of the imagination Let's go dump all of this stuff in here. Uh, you can go back in there, I guess. I guess we'll hold on to the geodes for now. And we can bring them tomorrow. Since we were unable to today. We have a boatload of ready more. We could just sell that and probably get up to the 10 million we need. And nothing flat. But I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to hold on to all these resources. Let's... 
see. You slimes can go back in here with the hardwood. Um, not a lot of time left in the day. I think we're just going to go to bed. Yep, we're just going to go to bed. We will say goodnight to our dog. And to Leah. It's so quiet and peaceful in the evening. Nothing to distract you from the experience of living. I agree. There we go. Day 17 of fall, year 4. As you can see, we are pretty far along in our in my main playthrough farm. Um, I have not showcased this farm, uh, except in the live stream. There is a... Uh, a let's play series uh, that I started on Stardew Valley if this is the first video you're seeing of mine uh, if you check out my channel there are other uh, other Stardew Valley videos on there um, one tutorial I'm working on some more tutorials but my main let's play is on a forest farm and I'm playing it from the standpoint of a lumberjack so uh, it's been a lot of fun. We, we've we been on quite the journey. I just uploaded the first video of fall on that one. So, um, so yeah, we're coming right along on that one. That one, obviously, we're in year one. We're not in year four like we are in this one. Um, let's start out the day, and we will talk to Leah. Good morning, Sajin. I made some coffee. My morning just wouldn't be complete without a hot cup of coffee. I agree. In fact, I'm going to drink your coffee right now. Not that I don't have a bunch. Because, I, I mean, I, <laughs> I'm carrying around 44 cups of coffee. No big deal. Rutabaga is still sleeping. And has been for quite some time. Let's check the weather report. Welcome to Kozu 5, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to rain all day tomorrow. Okay, well... Spirits are neutral, and living off the land. Welcome to living off the land. Fish focus, albacore. The fish can be found either in early morning or at night. Look for it in the ocean, in fall or winter. And my dog is behind me, shaking around, making a lot of noise. Dear Sajin, you're such a good neighbor, I thought I'd send over some animal feed to make your job easier. Keep it up, Marnie. Well, thank you, Marnie. I do appreciate it. All of our hunting is done. And all of our diamonds. Oh my gosh. So much honey. Now this was not the most optimum uh, bee house layout. I would not advise doing your bee house this way. Strictly because if you accidentally, and this is where having a tool hit thing on is important, uh, I have to walk in between my flowers to get these. And if I'm not careful, I can accidentally pick the flower, which... The flowers are in close enough proximity to the bee houses that I think I would only need the one. But still, I, ideally I would have left a space in between these so that I wouldn't accidentally pick up the flower. Um, Iridium, we can get two of you on the go. So let's go ahead and do that. And let me pop in here and we will just grab... No, I don't want to drink the travel oil. That would probably be pretty nasty, I would guess. Pretty nasty indeed. Um, let us dump the fairy rose honey, the truffle oil in there. And um, we're just going to sell the hay. Thank you, Marnie. I appreciate it, but we are all full up on hay for right now. Please do not take it as an insult, but I am passing it on to someone else for someone else to utilize. All these diamonds can go in there. What do we have in here? Nothing ready yet. Uh, animals, you know what? We're not going to let the day slip away from us again like it did before. Animals, you're just going to chill for right now. And we are going to go straight away to Clint's to get all these geodes opened. Because I don't want to miss out on that again. And we almost did. Well, we did actually yesterday. So I don't want to miss out on it today. Opens at 9 a.m. Okie doke. Uh, we will come down here and grab this blackberry because it is there. And we got two blackberries actually. And now you should be open. Clint, my good man, please process all of these geodes. We will start with the crappiest of geodes. And we got a Jagawite. Uh, let's go with the frozen geodes next. 
some copper. Hey, I'm not sure what you are. Uh, you are a soapstone, which we've already given one of you to Gunther, apparently. Frozen tear. Gold. A opal. Okay. And some coal. And we'll go with the magma geodes next. A helvite. Obsidian. Okie doke. A lemon stone. Some more gold. Good bit of gold, actually. That was a good find. Uh, a bixite. Some clay. And finally, a jasper. So, pretty sure all of these we've given to Gunther before. None of these say anything about giving them to Gunther. In fact, ones, no, there's definitely still some ones we have not given to Gunther. Not 100% sure what they are. But all of these, yes, there's that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. I think those are all the ones we grabbed from that one, the big site, yeah. We've already given all of these to Gunther, so we can just sell these back to Clint. You, sir, can have all of this. And we will just take all your money, is what will happen. Obsidian, and Lemonstone, and a Bixite, and the Jasper, and the Jagawite, and the Soapstone. You can have all that. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Nice doing business with you. Have a nice day. Let us go back. And we will need to check on our Aminals. Ride like the wind, Shadow Fax. And we'll start with the picks today. Oinky oink oink. I see you. Oink oink oink. Oink oink. There we go. You guys can come out and enjoy the day. You will not be able to enjoy the day tomorrow. We definitely need to make sure we close your close your, uh, your barn door. Hello, goats. How are you? Can I have your milk? Please and thank you. And you can come out. And cows. Hello, cows. All the cows. How are you? So many cows. Moo, moo, moo. Excuse me, pardon me, come on. My belt, my belt. Can you have it? Have I already told I must have already told you about it. Galley. Golly. Not galley. Galley would be a kitchen. Some place you probably don't want to be. Now if I'm being being honest. Why? Seriously? I'm not trying to fish in the barn. Hello, my little sheep. Cotton Eye Joe, how are you? Wooly, how's it going? Mittens. Alright, let's head on out of here. And we will open. Nope, Frank, please. Let's go get all of this stuff on the go that it is out of our inventory and we have room to pick up the eggs. We probably should have picked up most of this copper, if I'm being honest. All of this stuff here. Uh, any more milk? No. This milk on the go. There we go. And all of this wool, of which there is a boatload. Boatloads of wool. Perfect. 
Uh, we should have enough space to pick up the eggs, I think. Can I get in there, please? Thank you. Oh, I opened the door. Uh, new baby chick is hatched. Awesome. Uh, Maku. Uh, sure. Let's roll with it. Roll with it. Can I... I don't want you to come out yet. Now, how many chickens are we up to? One, two, three, four, five... Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three. Yep, somebody's gotta go. Somebody has to go. Who are we talking to? Rebel? Zuzu. Oh, you've been around for a while, Zuzu. Taters, you've been around for a while, too. Uh, I don't really necessarily want to get rid of... We got another brown chicken, so let's get rid of a brown chicken. So what's our oldest brown chicken? Cozy? Cheaper? You're 10 months old, dude. You, It might be you. You might be up for the chopping block. Yep, cheek is only 3 months. Cheaper? We love you, sir. You will sorely be missed. We will see you another time. Goodbye, sir. Goodbye, and thank you for your services. Uh, let's do... Let us go ahead and get... I guess it doesn't matter what quality of egg. Let's just do a white egg. We'll do... In fact, can we do the little one? Will the little one still hatch a chicken? It doesn't matter at all. I don't think that it does. Get another chicken on the go. Let's get all of you sorted out. Hello, dinosaurs, lizards, whatever you are. You left us two eggs today. I was just saying that whole thing about not getting more than one egg a day. And you must have heard me. Rabbits. How many of you are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11. Okay, there's only 11 of you, so y'all could still... You have the potential to still make another rabbit, so we will leave you be. Actually, did I count that correctly? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, only 11 of you. And ducks. How are we on the ducks? Oh, we got a new duck. We got a new duck. Uh, Tatsa? No, we're not going to name you Tatsa. We're going to name you... Duckburg. Sorry, my phone was going crazy there. Uh, Duckburg. You have now put us up to, I believe, 11 ducks? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. No, 12 ducks. Okay. Um... That means someone's got to go. Who will it be? Who's our oldest duck, Mallard? Daffy, you've been around for nine months. Quackerjack, good lord. You've been here for ten months, dude. Ten months. Ten months you've been around, and you were the one. Quackerjack, we love you, sir. I hope you have a great life wherever else you may end up. Goodbye. Goodbye, dear sir. Uh, let's get... What is our lowest quality duck egg? You are a lowest quality duck egg. So we will... Stick you in there. And now we have another duck. On the way. Let me get past you, please. Please and thank you. Please, please and thank you. Please and please and... Good lord. Uh, you can just go straight in here. Along with you. Ooh, do we have a purple one of you yet? I can't remember. We do. So, you can get sold. Along with this iridium, because frankly, we got plenty of it. Uh, Clay, hit the road, Jack. Give me all of this wool. And all of this cheese. No, don't eat the cheese. Do not need to eat the cheese. 
We do need to get these eggs going, though. Uh, we'll put you there. Put you you're gonna get sold uh, eggs. No, duck egg first. Duck egg is the more valuable mayonnaise. And then I think the void mayonnaise comes after that. If I'm not mistaken. And then it's the regular mayonnaise. Perfect. Um, we have one piece of wool that we can get going. Throw all of the stuff in here. We don't need you. We don't need you. We don't need you. And in fact, we're just going to chuck that egg. Just going to chuck it. Let's get all of this gold going. Do we have enough to do any more? Uh, we do. Uh, we have enough of you. That is not enough of you. That is enough of you, though. So we need one more coal. Fantastic. Let's get our... Mushrooms. No, don't eat the mushroom. No, don't eat the mushroom. Copper bar. You can go in here. Mushrooms. You can go in here. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, let's go down here and check on our wine. Check on our jam. Our jellies as it were. Uh, doesn't look like there's much going on with you. We'll check on our slimes. Oh, slimy slime slimes. No, shut the door. Now, let us just... How much is it to make one of you? Two iridiums and a hundred slimes. Hatches slime eggs into slimes allow you to raise slimes outdoors. Uh, slime egg press. Compresses a hundred pieces of slimes into slime egg. It's a miracle of science. Um, I think I want one of you. I think I want to make some new, some new slime eggs. Did you see that? I saw that. That was weird. So what did we need? We needed a battery pack. We needed a fire quartz. What else did we need? Bat wings, I think, maybe? Was it bat wings? No, it's coal. Which is not an issue because we have boatloads of it. Battery pack and fire quartz. Perfect. Let's get one of you. In fact, we'll just do two of you. Not that we really need two of you necessarily, but we have the stuff to to make you, so we might as well sell that. Grab the rest of our slimes. Now that we have all of the hardwood that we need. Let's head back into our slime hutch, and we will put these things down and make a couple of slime eggs. Now I don't know, I don't know if it matters what um what slimes you use for this. slimes it's going to give us is the question. 
like, will it potentially give us a red slime or an iridium slime? Like, because getting iridium slimes in here would be amazing. In fact, I'd love to have nothing but iridium slimes in here. It would be pretty cool. Let's go and pick up the rest of these slimes, though. Pick you back up in there, and I think that's it. Let's go check on our machines. Horse, you were hiding back there. Oh, I know what we need to do. We need to shut all our gates. It's gonna rain tomorrow. We can't have our animals being pissed off. Shut all of these right away. Shut you down. Shut you down. Shut you down. Shut you down. No, don't eat the truffle. Definitely more truffles today. Pigs were truff truffle in the day. Uh, I think that's it on the truffles. Yeah, I don't see any more. So let's go get these going. And we can pick up everything along the way. No, stop it, please. Fantastic. We'll grab all of this mayonnaise. These things can go right in the bin. Don't need to keep any of you. And that's it. Everything sorted out. Grab all these gold bars. Put them away in their chest. Grab our horse. Put Shadow Fax in his stable. And then to bed we will go. Doggy. It's so much lovelier here at night than the garish glow of the city. Everything worked out perfectly for me. I'm very lucky. I'm glad you feel that way, Leah. I truly am. Good night. And for today, we made... 72,000 gold. A lot of that was the diamonds... How much do we get for that petrified slime? 120? Eh. It's something, I guess. And most of that, the fairy rose honey, along with the rest of our random gubbins of things. But that is going to be it for this. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, this was a little bit different of a video than what I'm normally posting. Normally I'm doing my series, but I thought I'd hop into this farm and just give you guys another look at it. Um, uh, it like I said, if you didn't catch the live stream, please go back and do that. Uh, it was my first live stream, so it, it there were some, some audio issues with getting the game sound and all that going, but hopefully I've gotten all of that straight uh, and I have my setup, you know, in a way that will work both for recording and for live streams because I would like to start doing some more live streams at least one a week uh, possibly on Thursdays I don't know I'll have to see how that plays out but at any rate I hope you guys enjoyed leave a like leave a comment don't forget to subscribe consider sharing the video with your friends and family I do appreciate your support so very much and I will see you guys in the next one take it easy